Happy New Year, guys. We are back, and this is going to be the first gameplay officially of the New Year, man. The last gameplay, even though we released it on New Year's, that was in 2003. This is finally going to be gameplay from the New Year, man. Let's freaking go. And today, our freaking team is still pretty much the same, except for this man right here, Devin Hester. Now, I know I told y'all I'm not a fan of out of position. But this car actually makes more sense because Devin Hester, it just reminds me of, it's like an early campus hero to me because obviously this dude, Devin Hester, played for the Falcons. Obviously, I'm a Falcons fan. But in college, he played cornerback. And I believe when he did play for the Falcons, it was probably like one play or something or something like that. He did go on defense. So to have Hester like this and 95 speed, 95 acceleration, 95 agility, 91 jumping, I will put this man in the thumbnail, but I'm gonna be real. He, you know, what I'm saying he wasn't really tested. I don't want, I don't want to clickbait nobody. You know, what I'm saying I want y'all to actually see what's going on. But if you guys look at his stats, his juke moves in '93, it doesn't feel like he changed direction '95. It doesn't feel like it either. His spin move, ball carrying moves. I don't know. When I use a car, it seems like CP is a lot better when it comes to movement on the hit return. But yeah, I would actually like this car if it was a right receiver, by the way. But as a cornerback. He's on the team, and he is starting our, as our kit returner. But like I said, we ain't going to put him in a thumbnail or nothing like that. This is a team overall gameplay, man. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into it. Hey, I appreciate y'all. Uh, even though I'm a Falcons fan, y'all Bears fans are going crazy on my videos, man. So maybe I do need to get an Alshon Jeffrey gameplay soon when they get our coins up. And would it be DJ Moore, but that man go for 970000 man. So let's go ahead and get into the gameplay right now. Let's go what's up guys let's go let's start out this new year man he has randy moss micah parsons and tj watt and that is our team larry Fitzgerald, odell beckham and jesse bates as we kick it off to randy moss let's go we are in atlanta right now as the analyst is trying to catch up to we can't but nice hit stick right there but i believe that's barry sanders as he hands off the cave ellis i won't mind having that card on my team but as y'all know cp is doing great for us man second and one Michael Vick, for some reason, has all freaking day, man. And he throws it in his incomplete as Jesse Bates tries to fly down there and get the interception. But third and one, the Ron Payne right there is showing why he was one of the best defensive tackles in the game right now. But on fourth and three, y'all know how this game gets, man. Crazy stuff has happened. Now this dude, as everybody disengages, the dude dots me up in the middle of the field out of nowhere. Next play. Oh, he's running with Payton Hillis. And Cam Riley is right there to stop him. By the way, if y'all don't know, oh, oh, eh, swat right there. If y'all don't know, Patrick Peterson is off the team. So what we did, we moved Cam Riley to the slot. And we have uh, Devin Hester on the outside along with, oh, shoot, along with Night Trey Lane. As you see right there, we get a, oh, oh, nice pick by Jack Campbell. A nice user pick right there. And Jack Campbell is freaking gone all the way for the pick six, the first pick six of the year. Is Jack Campbell. I remember when we first got that man, it took us a minute to get used to him. And that dude has seen enough. Let's go to the next game as they try to lag us up right when we walk in right there. Let's go. That is our team. That is his team. Derrick Henry, Will Levis, and Jack Tatum. The dude has a Titans theme team. And he has a Titans uniform. Let's get it. Devin Hester. Let's see what he can do. Oh, he's going to the left side of the field. Hester. Hester. Oh, we tried to spin move back to the other side. But it was too late. That's right there. That You see a little bit of lag. But let's get it, man. First play on offense. Michael Bate looking a pass. We're trying to throw it deep. Ugh. And we thought, thought we mossed him, but that man, he broke it up right there as we hand off the CP. And they're all over me, man. Third and 12. Here we go. Michael Bate looking a pass. We touch. He touches the hand of Odell, but he swats the ball out. I just saw the stuff activator. But like I said, guys, we got Ken Riley. We got Devin Hester. And we got Night Train Lane. Devin Hester. And night trailing on the outside, can't rally in the slot. Like I told y'all, Patrick Peterson did really great for us, man. But he just got super, super outdated. He lasted probably longer than a lot of people did on the team. But 86 speed at this time, it wasn't, you know, going on. So anyway, as you see right here, he tries to do RPO to Terry Tate, right? And I know how to stop it. But look at this guy, guys. Because I did it again. I, I manned up the guy with the, with a the linebacker. And I guess it dude called a timeout. He was like, this dude knows how to stop it. So what he did, he literally paused the game and quit the game because I know how to stop it. 
<laughs> so next game, I told you the way to start this year was freaking nuts. So already two freaking quits in this game. So we go from a Titans theme team to a Giants theme team. So let's freaking get into it as we kick it over to that man Tony as he's juking like a maniac, going left, right, upside down, and Barry Sanders once again going crazy on the freaking kickoff as the dude's handed off to that ninety what was it, ninety five, ninety six Saquon Barkley. Michael Vick, obviously he didn't play for the Giants, but he has Michael Vick at quarterback. And right there, he throws her right into the dirt. And Caden Ellis is celebrating, like, yeah, it ain't happening. It ain't happening. Michael Vick, like, go up. I told you I'd go up. That's funny. Third and 12. Let's get it, man. What are we going to do? Can we stop this man from scoring? Can we stop this man from getting the first down? As he throws it, and look who it is, Night Train Lane, who's staying on the team right now. Fourth and 12. He's looking to pass. And I don't know if Devin Hester blew that coverage or not, man. What the freak was that, D. Hester? Man, dude, is this man about to lead a team already? We we spent four hundred and what fifty thousand on this man as a crazy hit right there by Jesse Bates. And I want to see what this man can do. Second and seven. We tried our hardest to like go crazy to get some gameplay with Devin Hester, but it didn't really work out as the wrong pain. It is putting a pain on Michael Vick. And look at this right here. He dunks out to Saquon. Saquon juking the life out of everybody. Third and 15, but they give him the first down. I thought he was a little short right there, but they give the man the first down, man. It's crazy. Now, it's first and 10 from Michael Vick, Saquon Barkley with the handoff, and Shaquille Leonard and Brandon Graham stop him for a loss, second and 11. Look at, look at, look at this man. Is that Deron Payne again? Deron Payne almost gets another sack, but of course, they always have the animation where they get the ball off, and they try to lag me right there. They try to get, make me get off sides, but thankfully, I stopped. And the next play, sacked. Sacked by Deron Payne and Aaron freaking Donald. Deron Payne is going nuts. Fourth and 25. Let's go. And he's almost sacked by Calais Campbell. Let's freaking go, man. Calais Campbell's hyped up. He's rallying around the team. Let's get it. Michael Vick. First and 10. We seeing what's going on. You know what I'm saying? The dude is in the zone over there. We don't care about none of that. Michael Vick. First play. Ugh, we mossed that man Banks. And we get a first down. Let's freaking go. Michael Vick. I'm like, all right, bet. He don't have no out of position people at the safety. That's all I need to see. So we try to throw it to Tony G. But nice swat at the last second by him. I have no idea who that is. Maybe that's Darren Wilson. Michael Vick looking to pass. We try to go over the top. But I believe, I don't know if he had an X Factor. Or not an X Factor, but uh, ability on him to knock it out. But the next play, Julio Jones, even though I believe DRC was in the zone, it was a touchdown for Julio Jones got in the end zone. And he just straight up dusted that man while he was in his own. So let's freaking go. Nice slant across the middle of the field on the other side of the field. And there's a touchdown by Julio. It's been a long time since he had a touchdown on my team. Since he came on the team. But he is still that guy. It's crazy how I realized like the other day he had two touchdowns with the Eagles. As we almost get a sack with Brandon Graham. Handing off to Saquon. Shaquille Leonard. And Deron Payne. Yo, these dudes are going nuts. Like I said, it's the whole defense. Hey, look, look at this man. He just pushed him down. Brandon Graham pushing the mess out of this dude. The defense is playing out of their mind. Look at this. Shaquille Leonard is in his own with dual threat. As Calais Campbell is looking to sack this man. Shaquille Leonard is right there. And he is sacked by Deron Payne once again. 2.5 sacks for Deron Payne. And this dude has seen enough. These This defense alignment is going insane right now. As right there, we, did, we put the card in there because we are about to go against a guy. With the freaking Detroit Lions theme team. What's up with all these theme teams? It is crazy. But we are playing in the London field, if I'm not mistaken. Let's go. Yes, and that's Devin Hester. Devin Hester right there. We get to the 19-yard line, and you see this man's name is DDA, which is very interesting because y'all know how this game gets, especially after those quits that just happened and stuff like that. It gets pretty wild. CP, oh, we tried a little cut right there, but Jack Campbell gets to stop. Ugh. CP once again, CP going on left side, and we get second and one, two rushes for 17 yards for CP as we do a play action because we ran the ball. So we're trying to throw it up to Kyle Pitts, but look at this. He said you here? Dude just lunges at him with no ability, just like, like it was nothing. Third and one. If it's one yard, we give it to freaking King Henry, and King Henry gets us that one yard play action right here as we're looking to pass. But that man, I don't know who the heck that is. Who the heck is B. Jones? That man flew straight up in there. But we hand out the CP right there on second and 23. Third and 10. That's that freaking Arthur Smith play call right there. But 
they wouldn't give it to CP. They probably would have gave it to like the fourth string running back or something. I don't know what the heck is going on. But anyway, let's get it right here. They probably would have gave it to Janu Smith at running back. But that was a nice dot right there to Tony Gonzalez, man. Good clutch catch right there as we head off the CP. Good block by Odell Beckham. Oh, look. Oh, oh. Freaking juking the freaking mess out of Honey Badger right there. And we try to hand off to Barry Sanders. Funny enough, we're going against the Lions. And this is the 91 overall Barry Sanders that you get from the field pass. We got the upgrade token and we used it on Barry Sanders since we do not use Teddy Hendricks. Third and freaking goal. Second and three. We're looking to pass. And look at his dot right there. Look at the dot. That's what Tony G was known for. The red zone threats. Look at this. Celebrate. Look at, look at the old teammates of Julio Jones and Tony Gonzalez as they're celebrating right there. Look at his dot once again. Look at this. Ugh. Ugh. Right in there. Over, the, over and under, baby. That's what I like to see. Nice freaking play right there. Nice catch. Nice pass by Michael Vick. And we are about to go up by seven points, man. Let's freaking go. 12 plays, 61 yards. As he freaking does a read option with Andrew Luck. We try to strip it right there with Night Train Lane. Surprisingly, that it worked. But that's Andrew EA Luck. And we have been winning some games. So that's why the dude is wide open. As Jesse Bates hit sticks him on his legs. Andrew EA Luck is looking to pass. It is, he's a dot over the middle. As Shaquille Leonard makes a stop, he's two for two for 25 yards. Look at this, he does an RPO, so I'm like, oh shoot. Now we gotta watch out for the RPO. I know exactly what to do. And so you see we manned up the guy right there with the linebacker. But he throws it somebody else. The St. Brown, we gotta be careful. St. Brown is a freaking dog in real life and in this game, so we have to be careful with him. As he tries to run it with Barry Sanders. But Deron Payne is right there. Even John Madden is like, yeah, that was nice, dude. The Ron Payne is freaking going insane in this freaking game. I'm talking about straight up dominating every single game that has been in his gameplay right now. As Andrew Luck is looking to pass, and he does a nice little comeback route or a curl route or a out route, whatever freaking route that was. It was nice. As he does an RPO, and it's almost picked off by Paulo Malo, but he said it was a flag. It was roughing the passer by Brandon Graham. So anyway, Andrew EA Luck is looking to pass. And he is almost sacked, but that was a crazy dot. Night Train Lane was all over him, but he gets it. So it's 7-7 seven seven right now. And Devin Hester, a little gameplay for Devin Hester. Devin Hester on the left side of the field. But I want to see him actually go for the touchdown or do something on defense. Michael Vick, first and 10. He throws it to CP right here. Oh, nice little spin move. But Tyreek Woolen was all over it. Michael Vick looking to pass. And look at this. Odell Beckham Jr. on the right side. Oh, look at that. Oh. He, he broke both ankles. Oh my gosh. I'm out of breath myself re watching it. And it's a freaking touchdown, man. Let's freaking go. Signature move for Odell freaking Beckham Jr. Let's freaking go. That was freaking amazing. This dude is still that guy showing why he was the cover athlete for Madden 16. Good stuff right here. But I told y'all, look at this man name. That DDA stuff. For some reason, they didn't let me stop it when I wanted to. Um. So yeah, that was 13 to 7. Y'all know what time it is. I'm trying to tell y'all, when y'all win a lot of games, crazy stuff happens. So we have to be careful. First and 10 for this guy. Andrew EA Luck with the handoff to Barry Sanders and Caden Ellis and Jack Campbell right there. Stop him. As he's trying to do RPO to Anquan Bowden. I thought it was Megatron for a minute. I saw the 81. I saw the Lions uniform. But Anquan Bowden, as he hands it off to Barry Sanders and Night Train Lane comes up with another big tackle. He does another freaking RPO to Anquan Bowden. Good stuff. We are right there all over it. And he tries to go to the left with Barry Sanders. And Aaron Donald is right there, man. Yes. Andrew EA Luck. He's looking to pass. And it's picked off by Terry Tate. Terry Tate. They freaking picked the ball off. We put him in his own. And I think that man is gone. I don't know if y'all missed that, guys. But uh, I'll put in the clip right here. But look at a freaking amazing block that Brandon Graham did. Right after this freaking field goal right here. Ugh. Look at this. I do can grab my seat there. Look at they tried to lag. They tried to deviate me, but we got it just in time. Look at this. Boom. <laughs> that was what happened right there on that pick six. Good block as Williams gets the freaking kickoff. And look at that man, Caden Ellis, the most underrated linebacker in the real life and in the game. And he tries to do an out route with Reynolds, and it's working for him. 20-7 to seven right now. And look at the Deron Payne. Try to go crazy. We tried to strip him right there. But it's second and one as he's handing off to Barry Sanders. I don't know what the heck happened to Jack Campbell. 
The dude dove out of the freaking frame as Terry Tate makes the tackle, man. The whole entire defense is going crazy, but it's being led by Deron Payne. Now, Andrew EA look is looking to pass, and this man Laparta is wide open. I told y'all when this man got drafted, he was going to be a stud, but I do not want this man going in against me. He's hyped up, but it's first and 10. Andrew EA look. We shade it to the inside with this man, Troy Palabalo Palabalo. Right there. Let's go. But it's 11 seconds on the clock. Michael Vick with the play action. Michael Vick looking to pass. He's throwing to Larry Fitzgerald. Yes. Larry Fitzgerald with the freaking Moss on McNeil. Nobody's going to catch him. Touchdown. It is 26 to 7 as time expires in the freaking second quarter. He's about to give him the F5 freaking Alex Mack. No, okay, it's not that five. He would just celebrate with him. I thought he was about to hit the Brock Lesnar on him, but he didn't do it. Michael Vick launched that thing, man. And that dude, Brown dude, uh, whatever his name is, I, I don't know his first name. He was about to come in there and get me as we kicked the field goal 27 to 7. One play, 76 yards. And it took 11 seconds for number 11. Good stuff, 27 to 7. That's what I like to see as we kick the ball off uh, to this man, Williams. And, uh, uh, uh. I guess the guy, by the way, had to think about it for a minute. But this dude is out of here, man. I appreciate y'all. We out, man. Let's go. Came from foreign lands to please the Falcons fans. Arriving in backpacks on his brother's back. Now he's in the spot with my dogs, the block. Friday afternoon, hanging with the block. Hanging with the block. Up in the spot with my dog, the block. Hey, Ha! 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 Ha!